If the promise of free airplane tickets arrived at your doorstep tomorrow, you might think it was a holiday miracle or proof you were definitely on the nice list this year. When it happened to us, we were skeptical and decided to track down this free vacation. Guess what happened? Here's ABC's chief business and economics correspondent, Rebecca Jarvis. Tis the season for giving and traveling. So when two free airline tickets anywhere in the country plus two nights at a hotel show up in the mailbox, it may seem like holiday cheer. Just going to go in and ask them a couple of questions. Tonight, we're on a mission tracking the anatomy of a free vacation yeah. runaround. So where's what our free trip? Those gifts? Our story starts here a couple of months ago. So Almin got this note where our then executive producer received a letter congratulating him on a dream vacation that says, in addition, you will receive two nights at any one of our over 1,000 Marriott hotel locations. The retail value of this award is up to $1,398. Sounds pretty good. <laughs> there was just one problem. When we Googled the phone number we were supposed to call, we got this. Complaints, and lots of them, from people who received letters just like this one. And it all goes back to that phone number. That phone number. That we're about right to call there. right now. So we decided to schedule an appointment with this mystery company. I received a letter in the mail telling me to call this number um, about uh, some free tickets. To claim our free trip. It sounds like you're telling me if I come, I stay for the 90 minute presentation, I get two tickets, sounds like a good deal. On the day, we sent two ABC News producers wearing hidden cameras Button cam. to attend the seminar and pick up those free tickets. But if you look at this inside, it's actually a camera. The location in Brooklyn, New York. Well, good afternoon. How's everybody doing? All right. All right, all right, all right. The seminar kicks off with James congratulating the group on being invited. Whatever gifts were promised to you for coming out today, you are going to receive it, whether you join here today or not, because this is a presentation about vacation and travel. What we find is a relentless sales pitch that lasts more than 90 minutes. Well, guys, let me break it all down for you. Now, if this program can't save you one nickel, then I suggest that you don't buy. But everybody in this room sounds like you've done a little travel. So you will be very impressed with what I'm going to share with you. At the conclusion of the seminar, James's associates come in to close the sale for vacation packages that cost thousands of dollars. You know, we think we're just going to not sign up. I'm sorry. But that doesn't seem to make a difference. As it becomes apparent, our producers are not willing to sign up. They're moved to three different locations with three different salespeople, each trying to get us to sign up. Congratulations. Welcome uh, aboard. Uh, Welcome aboard. Over two this hours the, after um, we walk in the door, we're still empty handed. Like What's up with the, with the you, tickets you, that we're We're eventually given these vouchers for a free trip. So far, our free trip has only cost us the two hours we spent at the seminar. But there's more. To get the actual vouchers, we have to send in money? That's not a trip. <laughs> Well, it's an activation form. And we sent in $150 only to get more offers asking for more money. An activation form. That's right. 15 days after sending in our activation form, we didn't get tickets in the mail, but instead a solicitation for more money. It's been about two months now since we first met PPV Travel in Long Island. Now we've tracked them down in New Jersey, and we're going to go meet them at one of those 90-minute presentations so we can ask them a few questions. We understand that they're in the basement right now preparing to give one of these presentations that we've already visited. We know basically what happens inside and we're just going to go in and ask them a couple of questions. When we first walked in, we saw some of the same familiar faces from that Hi. first seminar. How are you? I'm Rebecca Jarvis with ABC News. But they quickly left, leaving us with this guy who calls himself Thorn. I'm just going to ask a couple of quick questions. Okay. At the presentation, we were told Again, that we had qualified for this complimentary travel, right? Mm -hmm. And then we were asked to pay $150 for that travel. We, we did pay the money, but instead of getting any kind of complimentary travel, instead we were sent these. Is this, okay. is this a ticket? These are the certificates from the third party marketing company. So does that, is that a ticket? Is that my complimentary travel? Over the next 20 minutes, Thorne dodges question after question. Does it say PPV anywhere on here? And can't seem to explain why that free trip 
costs so much money. But again, I'm not seeing any free tickets. Nothing complimentary here. I, I appreciate you. It, it is complimentary. They are free gifts. They are complimentary. Where, where are the complimentary tickets? I, I'll be forward with you. We give a 90-minute presentation. If you attended a presentation, then this form was signed. The company claims that the free gifts are fulfilled by an outside company, and they're not responsible for fulfilling the trip. Okay. I'll be frank with you. Again, that's what this says. You were promised gifts from a third-party provider. The New York Attorney General says third-party companies can be a sign of trouble. These companies manage to evade prosecution uh, and make it harder for offices like mine to track them down by changing their names, uh, changing the descriptions. We sent in the money. We got these. Then we were told if you want the ticket, you have to pay an activation fee for $59 a person. Which was identified. That's not complimentary. Yeah, it was the form that you were promised for coming in. If you read the small print on the back. No Thorne admits that you have to jump through hoops. Three, you have to jump through hoops or complimentary. You yes. jump through hoops. Correct. How many hoops did you jump through? Just an estimation. To put it frankly, you mail these in, follow the instructions, provided all instructions are followed. For instance, you got these. As long as you follow these individual instructions, you will receive two round trip airline tickets anywhere in the continent of the United States, as promised. Thorne requested a second interview in his offices, but what neither he means? nor anyone else from PPV so Travel ever got call. back to us. Thank you. Thanks. So we still don't have that complimentary hotel stay or those complimentary tickets that we were promised. And now we've been offered a new deal. That, that's what we've got in front of us right now, a new opportunity to do more business with this company, but still no tickets. No hotel, none of the complimentary stuff that we were promised up front. If someone is calling you up or emailing you or writing you a letter with something that seems too good to be true, it probably is not true. For Nightline, I'm Rebecca Jarvis in New York.